Untitled, Jan Mitchell Basquiat. Early in 1981, Basquiat started working on Untitled, Contrary to the majority of his works, which were enthusiastically finished within a few days, Basquiat put off finishing Untitled for a number of months. Untitled, or Skull, a piece of Basquiat's early canvas-based work, has a patchwork skull that resembles the Frankenstein monster from Mary Shelley's novel in that it is made up of disparate parts that are stitched together. The skull is both a contemporary graffiti artist's take on a long Western tradition of self-portraiture, and the signature piece of a street-smart bohemian, suspended before a background that resembles parts of the New York City subway system. The skull-like face has a dejected expression, and the rough stitches allude to an unhappy amalgamation of its parts. Together with the jagged lines, the colors blending and swirling hints at facial bruises or wounds suggest violence or its aftermath. The troubled three-quarter profile is equally inscribed with Basquiat's recent past as a curbside peddler, homeless person, and nightclub personality at the time he created this piece. Together, these traits imply that the painting becomes a weary icon of the exiled Puerto Rican and Haitian immigrant, Basquiat, who seemed to believe that he was destined to stay, even as he successfully navigated the newly gentrified streets of 1980s Soho and the art market. Between life and death, Untitled shows the inside and outside dimensions of a head. The eyes appear vacant, as though the head had been lobotomized, in contrast to the vibrant colors that imply a flurry of internal activity. The expression is subdued. The use of heads and skulls by Basquiat is deeply rooted in his sense of self as a black American and is reminiscent of African masks. In order to address social issues, he developed a distinctive style that mixed words, symbols, and a variety of materials with expressive and occasionally violent brushstrokes. At Basquiat's first American solo exhibition at the Anana Nosai Gallery in 1982, the painting was displayed under the title Untitled. Soon after it was bought, the word skull was added to the title, and it has since been with the painting through many exhibitions. It was sold at auction in Sotheby's New York for a record breaking $110.5 million, a record amount at auction for the artist as well as for an American artist. If you liked the video, leave us a like and feel free to share it. Subscribe so you don't miss our future videos. Thanks for watching, see you soon on Art Theory.